Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Christian. Welcome back to another RF Online Play Park video. So we are now back in the Desolation server. And this is the Korra Alliance. I'm playing now with my Warrior Zealot. So for today's video, we'll have another short one. And it is about this item here. The Potion Buff expansion capsule so it's a pretty good item but it also has its pros and cons so we're gonna be discussing it so before we get started with the video uh, I'd first like to give a shout out to crayon from the Loki guild back in neo nexus server so thank you so much for supporting the video and guys if you haven't subscribed yet to the video Go ahead and click that subscribe button. It only takes a few seconds and it's going to help out the channel a lot because I always upload videos about RF Online Play Park. Well, let's get started with the video. First, we'll talk about where you get these Potion Buff Expansion Capsules. Okay, so you get them from the shop, cash shop. You click, you click it here at the bottom part of your screen and it's somewhere at, at the back okay where is that potion oh it's not really at the back I think it's in the front pages uh -huh. oh it's in this third page right now and if you check out the description miraculous capsule that allows usage of two different buff potions at the same time so some people would call the call this dual pots because you can use two potions at the same time so this is actually a very good item but if you check out the price it's 30,000 cash points so that translate to 300 philippine pesos so it's not cheap not really that expensive i, I think it's just right but if you're a light spender Okay, you don't want to spend too much on the game. This is kind of pricey. Uh, fortunately, it goes on sale every now and then. So sometimes it becomes 50% off. One, well, 15,000 cash points. So it becomes 150 pesos. So that's cheap. And the good thing here is that um, in uh, during the server problems, like last week, GMs and RF Online Play Park started to insert these in uh, active accounts. So it's a compensation. And some people are trying to sell it. And I think it is a good idea for you to stock up on these things because they're actually pretty good. So anyway, let's go ahead and try it now. Um, it actually lasts for 30 days. So once you click it, it activates and uh, the system will track if um, until when it's going to be active so just click it and okay you always get a notification on your lower right so it says there 30 days remain for the continuous use of a potion buff expansion effect um, click OK so now you can use two kinds of potions okay um, for example I have myself a bust potion all right, and just wait for the cooldown of the potions. Okay, and you can use both bust potion for attack and protect potion for defense. So this is very good. Um, you're stronger uh, and you have higher def, so that's good. But one thing you can't do is that uh, you can't use two potions of the same kind. For example, you already use a 40% bust potion. You can't use another. 50, for example, I have a 55% bust or I have adrenaline potion. So if you try to use it, see it goes over the top of the 40%. So you can't use 40 and 55% at the same time. So yeah, you can't stack all your attack. It's always going to be two different potions of different uh, two different kinds of potions so that's it but it's still pretty good and next up 
another disadvantage of uh, there's one disadvantage of the potion buff expansion um you can't really use your uh, candy potions so if you've been following my channel uh, i i like to use candy potions like these so they have no cooldown and oops okay they have no cooldown if you're not using a potion buff expansion but for example you already use your potion buff expansion it uh, it doesn't work so continuously see you can't use two similar potions at the same time so don't forget okay if you're going to pvp you have to remove your potion buff i mean your candy pots and you need to switch to your regular potions or you can use dq potions um let's see if i have one let's go back to hq the the dq potions are 6000 hp and they have i think a low cooldown so let's go ahead and check it out okay so let's get back to hq okay so right now there's not many people here in desolation server because it's only a few more days before the server merges with Neo Nexus server, so hopefully population goes up. Um, there, so if you're using potion buff expansion, it's a good idea for you to use these 6000 HP common potion from you get these from your DQ boxes, so they're very good. 1.8 seconds cooldown. You can use this when you're PvPing in chip war and in events, okay. And I'd like to talk about another disadvantage of the potion buff expansion. Um, I don't know if it's just me, but you can't really remove your death runes easily. So, for example, you're in a PvP situation and you click your death rune, right? So, you, monsters can't hit you. Um, normally, what you do to remove your death rune is that you use any other potions, right? But if you click, for example, that kind of potion, <laughs> you're still using your death rune because it, it removes the other buff on the left side. So if you click it again, there. <laughs> so <laughs> you need to use at least another two kinds of potions so for you to remove the death rune. So for example, it's chip war and you need to last hit the chip and you use death rune, you're going to have to wait a few more seconds to, to remove it. So... That's about it for the potion buff expansion. So if ever you see someone selling in the UTS, like, or in the chat, anything below 150 million, maybe 120, 130 million or less for the potion buff expansion, you should go ahead and buy it. Because um, normally it's kind of pricey and sometimes no one sells these things. So <laughs> that's a good idea um, to stock up. On these potion buff expansions well i guess that's it for today's video um my name again is christian thank you so much for watching if you guys like it don't forget to like the video comment down if you have questions and go ahead and check out my other videos in the channel because there's hundreds i think <laughs> um share the video with your friends and as always subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed yet because i always upload videos about rf online play park so that's about it I'll see you again in another RF Online Play Park video. Goodbye.